Welcome, Excel Byte Development Toolkit, or ADT for short, is an easy and flexible solution for distributing your game builds internally and tracking errors and crashes. ADT distribution can be accessed via the Excel Byte Development Toolkit Hub. ADT Hub is a dedicated executable compatible with Windows and Linux. It also supports platforms and engines such as PlayStation, Xbox, Unity, and Unreal. Here at Excelbyte, we have in-depth documentation which will walk you through setup and provide more detail in regards to all that ADT can offer. Here's the distribution hub. You can see there are three build channels visible, each of which can have different builds assigned. Developers can custom create any number of build channels and adjust access to which team members can see which build channels. For example, you may only want executives to have access to stable builds but provide QA with access to the latest unstable options. Here's what executives might see, but here's what QA might see themselves. ADT makes it easy to quickly upload new builds for other team members to access momentarily. All you have to do is find the game folder with your game EXE in it and drag and drop. The new build has been added to a new build channel. QA, for example, can now immediately access and download that build. If you wish to update a build channel with a new build, that's as simple as dragging on top of the existing build channel too. Let's say you wanted to provide a unique build channel for QA. You can do so by assigning specific groups to the build channels in the hub's appropriate tab. QA can then evaluate the build and change the build status for everyone on the team to see. An executive, for example, may wish to always have the latest build ready to go. The latest build will download in the background and automatically keep you up to date by using ADT's auto update feature. Now let's look at Excelbyte Development Toolkit's second major strength, error reporting. Error reporting can be accessed via the ADT web portal. Once integrated with your game, ADT's web portal will populate with development or live crashes and bugs reported by QA and other users. ADT provides intuitive filtering to be able to sort and view data in a user-friendly way. For example, you may want to view the top five crashes within a set period of time, or track what equipment and drivers users had when encountering issues. You can also filter to see all the issues experienced on a specific build. Let's say a QA tester was suffering from a crash on the development environment. That crash they were experiencing and all its similar crash events would be grouped here. Included in that crash is a call stack, a profiler, hardware information, and much more. When a crash occurs, that crash is retroactively recorded and made available within the ADT web portal. This feature makes debugging the issue easier by providing vital context surrounding the moments leading up to the crash. Finally, game users can log issues from within the game. A player needs only to press a configurable hotkey to screen capture a bug and provide additional information. That issue will automatically route to within the ADT web portal. Issues and crashes can also quickly be turned into JIRA tickets. The JIRA tickets will link to the ADT web portal and you can even resolve that issue from within the ADT web portal itself. I hope you've gained a better understanding of a few of the workflows Excel Byte Development Toolkit can alleviate and improve for your team. Thanks for watching. Excel Byte, celebrate boring launches.